Pacheco. Hi, I'm Shane with the Drum Center of Portsmouth in Portsmouth, New Hampshire. We are on the web at drumcenternh.com, and today we're going to bring you a little bit of a unique flavor, some drums from Italy. These are the Tamboro snare drums. Some of you may remember that we did a very cool video a few months ago featuring the Tamboro drum sets. In that video, we did feature some snare drums, but we wanted today's video to be just snare drums so that you could hear even more of them. Like all fine Italian recipes, there is a lot of effort that goes in to make the perfect sounding Tamboro snare drum. They really don't leave many stones unturned when it comes to developing and crafting their snare drums. And what has drawn me towards their drums is how unique they are. There are a few things that really set these drums apart from everybody else. And I like that because I'm always looking for a little bit of diversity in sound or attack or just overall vibe. And these drums have them uh, on all three counts. We are featuring quite a few snare drums today. One from the Opera series, which is their flagship line, the Unica series, and several of the metal snare drums. <laughs> One of the things that draws me to their snare drums is their throw off has a magnet on the inside of it, just as a nice little touch to make sure it stays put when you are playing it. The drums all feature Evans heads, either G1s or the UV1s. I think the UV one head is really great for brushwork. There's lots of sensitivity. I, when I hit them really you know, hard doing my rim shots, I do feel like the head is a little bit contained. The drums with the G1s on them were giving me what I was looking for out of a snare drum. But again, that's a very personal taste and what you like for heads is you know, obviously up to you. All the drums featured today also have the ST lug. I don't know what ST stands for. I'm going to assume it's super tough, but who knows? The Opera Series snare drum, this is a birch stave with beech rings, and it has the high pressure laminate on the outside of it. Now, when you look at the inside of this shell, you can see how cool it really is and how they were able to make it round is quite a feat. And stave construction, you know, can tend to be dry a little bit, but I found that this drum has a lot of bottom end, which I love, and of course the attack that I'm looking for. I think you'll find the same out of this one. The bass drum and floor tom that we are playing is the Opera Series, 22 inch bass drum and a 60 inch floor tom, which are just a joy to play, a thunderous, <laughs> it's a thunderous drum kit.
Unikiss series. Now, I have one of these snare drums myself. I, I love this, which is a very, very thin three-ply birch shell, which is sandwiched between two high-pressure laminate plies. And what this provides is a unique sound. What do you know? It's the Unica series. It's a bit of a different sound, different attack, and it just is a nice little fit in my lineup. I love the sound of it. The metal shells that Tamboro is offering is a little bit different from a lot of the other metal shells that we're seeing from other manufacturers. The bearing edges have a very tight rollover. The aluminum actually has two beads in it and the hoops are 2.2 millimeter triple flanged. Now they look like 2.3s to me, could be a misprint, I'm not sure, but what's really a millimeter between friends?
Drums like this, these are for people who are looking for something different. If they have a lot of snare drums in their lineup and they just want something that just hits a little bit different, these are perfect for that. Or it's great if it's your first high-end professional snare drum. These are a great option to look at. I'm really tickled with these. I, I really like what they're doing. I think they make fantastic drums. And well, the sound speaks for itself. Of all the drums that we have featured today, we would like to know which one was your favorite? Which one was your least favorite? Please let us know in the comments below. The links to buy these drums are also right in the description below. And also please click that subscribe button so that you get notified when we post new content like this. And as always, thank you so much for the support.